Hey, Liz Need here. A little straight talk about little things that will make your work life and your personal life amazing. Today we're talking about gratitude and thankfulness. I'm sure if you're a human being that you have received some help today and you also have offered help today. It's just part of connection. It's about the human experience. So first let me talk to the people who have offered help. Well, I gotta tell you, that's just the way it is. And if you take your ability to help someone as a way to validate who you are, then you're kind of doing it for the wrong reasons and you're never really truly going to be satisfied because nothing you do can validate your value. You're already valuable and connecting is just part of being a human. So you're really just being a really good human. Now the other side of it is if you are receiving help, uh, maybe you're cashing a check because of a referral that you got from someone or you're accomplishing a task that you could not have accomplished without the help of someone else. It's the best thing that you can do for all of us in your community to thank the people that helped you, to realize that you would have never gotten there alone and to just sit in the gratitude of that and accept it, that it doesn't make you weak and it doesn't hurt your pride. It actually reveals your strength as a human being. Do your best to thank the person out loud. Speak to them, send them a note, send them an email, better yet, post your gratitude to everyone. Really reinforce the connection process because even though we shouldn't be doing it so that we can get thanks, it feels really good to be thanked. And ultimately, it's the best thing for you. True authenticity, the acceptance that you just didn't get here alone will help you in the long run. I hope this helps you and I hope you can think of some people to thank. I am gonna roll some credits of people that I couldn't have done it without them. So you inspire me, you help me, and thank you so much.